could go quite deep. Still absolutely massive from this side. I've only come to ride my new bike. <laughs> Alright sports fans, we're here at the warehouse, we're back in Wales from Europe and today we are going to go and walk the new hardline track, I think maybe the top half is new, so half of this track is new, so you're going to see a lot of firsts here, I think this is going to go out the week of hardline, but before anyone's seen anything, so this is it, if you've tuned in you're about to see the most insane change, I've been up there once and seen a tiny bit of the steep, but nothing else, there's a huge new ridiculous candy gap so we're gonna cruise up there now it's raining today not ideal and then probably in this lsd as well it's lifestyle doco that's what it stands for we are going to be testing it so keep watching we're walking and testing the new wrinkle hardline wales track it's looking so ridiculous i know that come on this little guy's going to come with us and we take the landing up the hill now go meet the nice people from red bull we can see a terrifying scaffolding rolling there's scaffolding and i'm not a fan but <sighs> we'll be there in a minute. Lada, are you a hardline dog? No hardline dog. Yeah. Right, for people that don't know, this is the uplift route. This is the first drive up the uplift route of 24. <laughs> We're not sure how we feel. Honestly, I'm, I'm chilling now, but I'm going to be real nervous in a minute. Lada doesn't even know. He just gets to chill so hard. <laughs> <laughs> Little rascal. Right, for anyone who doesn't know, this is Jim Monroe, my photo test pilot, <laughs> and we're in his van. What he's done here, Jim, do you want to talk us through it? <laughs> well, we've got a hole in the roof, we've put a Land Rover roof on. We've got a Land Rover roof <laughs> of a Defender on his printer. 100 quid. 100, 100 quid. quid, good yeah, mod. Yeah. Bit, bit of tape holding it down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I love it. Well, it's good so hustle, Jim. Good. This is Jim's home. Oh, well, wait, we've just, seen, we've just seen the best bit of the mod. <laughs> She's looking good up here, Jim boy. Oh, I got respect. Hey, Lada. All right, so it's lightning the mood before we have to go down this track. We've got G-Man. G-Man has turned up. He's swearing at us. Oh, this is so good. We've got a hell squad out. we got Stand Steve on. here for it as well. <laughs> <laughs> this is Grace. She loves being on YouTube, everyone. <laughs> How'd that work out for you? Some people just say not meant for the camera. Oh. <laughs> and we're driving up now the uplift road. Here we are, landing of the old cannon. And you'll see now, the step up ramp jump is gone, which means we're going somewhere else. Somewhere else. Like a few bits of here. Oh, and the rain has actually stopped for two seconds. We might warm up the epic valley. All right, Steve's decided he's going to wear Crocs for today's track walk. But it says like left, look as right, right as left is where we're going to be heading down. And it is so steep. We'll kind of skip the walk up. I'll just click this on for the down. Oh, that is a cool, look at the wall of a verb. Right, I'll get, I'll get this in a minute. Well, while we look at these two insane verbs, unfortunately we can see a big scaffolding jump below us. Let's keep going up so we don't have to look at that. This is one of the most insane rams I've ever seen on a racetrack. Hey Lada! I'm too excited to film on the way down. We're going up still and still filming. There's a gnarly mini cliff drop here with a two bike length landing and then off into that huge berm. <laughs> Steve reckons it's out in control. George? Talk to me. Oh, you talk to me, mate. What do you think? Oh, are you not riding this year? Pretty chill, I guess. Oh my god, this is not chill. Right, Jim was thinking of going off the dirt where my feet are all the way to the lily pad. I'm thinking of rolling onto the rock and then down. We're trying to go up around this cliff section and we are knee deep in wetness. And my legs could not be wetter. They're coming through the socks now. <laughs> Yeah, pretty wet. Looks like there's a first new wood section and some gnarly cliffy roll thing here. Lada here. Watch out, son. Oh, here. Steph, grab that little guy. <laughs> Whoa. So, what have we got here? Crocs on. No. Well, she's got weak yesterday. Well, there's quite a bit of commitment involved with this shoot, hey? 
Oh my god! It was a hundred times better than before. Still quite gnarly. Spinning down. So you basically commit to this near vertical shoot to where Chaos and Jimmy are, and then there's a little gap down there. Pretty chill, but it's kind of diagonal off canvas slate rock. Isn't the best when it's this wet. It looks unreal. This is real hard line. This is ridiculous. Stop crying. Missed a few bits down there, but this used to be like right at the old start and this used to be gnarly. Now it's not even gnarly. This is uh, we're at the top with the build crew. They're slacking off, but they're building the... No, I'm joking, they're going hard. They are building the new start tower here. Should be ready for tomorrow. Full top to bottom. We're ready for it, mate. Top to bottom, what's your money on it tomorrow? Almost. <clears throat> a couple more days. Do you think we can do wait, a top to bottom tomorrow? Wait for this storm to pass. <laughs> Probably a good shout. Have a good one, Grace. Back on YouTube. <laughs> right, we're leaving the top. We are cruising. Fellow tester. <laughs> right, we're at the start. There'll be a ramp, which is cool. We have some speed, and we're basically into. We almost need to look at this, I guess we've got the lines next week, but it is really jagged gnarly rocks. Always in between the rocks, this mud is so slippy. Yeah, get dragged onto the rocks. Yeah, and it's, I reckon it's going to be at least 15 seconds more of top here, before the old track. There's a cool little outside or little mid slot line. It's all right, the rocks. Because you don't want to be too left. Right, we've got like a gnarly rock roll over here. Because you're going like across it. Oh my god, that's so gnarly. You don't want to put your front wheel into that hole. You want to be down through this, but not slide, because they are slanted. You see what I mean? Like, if you could go yeah, here, and then... Because it's kind of like a mini, like, yeah, that last rock. But these will be... Why would you come in? All right, and then kind of flatter rock section. It's so janky and gnarly. Proper, proper hard line. I'm going to probably say that a few times. We've got some pumpy rollers. Maybe a little wall ride section down the next one. Actual rock slab or holes. I fancy being over right. That's not too bad. I think a little hop over this hole here. And I think down, there's either a rut far right. It kind of doesn't track with track wall, but it should be just testing. A little rut down right or cut inside and you've got a tidal line at the bottom. And we're about to join up the old track. Just join, we've just joined the old track from the old track, the original track from last year. Now we're going to come in a lot quicker to this section than the old outer gate. So we're going to be flying, yeah, down the left. Flying. It's going to be way quicker into here. Into here. No, just because I used to start there and creep off the line and then come down. now you're like, yeah, and you're just going to have to get your braking, which is cool because it's hard to find your braking point and then just gap. All right, so we've got the first, it used to be the first turn. And the track went this way. This is now where it's super different. We go straight, similar to before, a gap off here and a rock slab. So we land on the slab and we come into what is the first, I guess woods, that techie section. You've got an up over or a hop over some rocks that are super, you can't really see these are high and off camber. That was a cool little knee flick. And then you want to hop the next and straight it out. But it's really way gnarlier than it looks. We gotta test this and make sure it all works, not every single person's gonna die. Because if this was at a World Cup, this is a really, really technical section just to ride through. So you go off where chaos is over that, and I'm thinking you would then gap down to the right, or you can come maybe here, gap that, stay left, and roll through. This is honestly way gnarly than it looks. Out of the woods, then we kind of got to pick up over some more rocks. This is where it gets so hectic. <laughs> where the crew is down here. And it gets real steep. Lot of man, get you off that cliff. I think, annoyingly you want to come in on the right to go over left, because if you stay left the whole way, it's quite aggressive, no? Yeah. If you could stay left the whole way, that'd be the best. But then you've got the, if you're in the mountain off camera, you're going to be fighting it the whole way, whereas if you come in slow on the right, first lap, Slow on the right, turn across to where this crying little dog is. And then in, down gap. So the first time I try this, tomorrow, you're going to have to commit to it. Can you drop in the top, you ain't stopping. Down, this looks like a way bigger compression from the top than even on this camera, but it's not. It's pretty much downhill, little lip. 
15, 20 foot gap. Yeah, yeah. Good reckon, Daniel. Terrifying. Terrifying from the man himself. <laughs> We're now below the cliff thing and it's got a huge run out. It's undulating. It is so sick with these big rocks. And a lot of me on. He is going to be so tired later. Beach earlier now, hard line. How are you, son? Now we're starting to go back down, down that big chute, and this is where we were before. You need to get us up over the rock. I think you do, you need to somehow get back there, check up over that rock. Wait till I'm a man, don't go off that cliff. Because if you come in here, it'll be too tight, so you really need to set up wide here, and then off this quite gnarly next gap. Yeah, right, we're getting nervous now, because if we test tomorrow, hopefully we do, and the weather's good enough, we'll probably start here, roll in off it, and then we'll start the rolling, run into it after. Right, we come off the little lily pad on off down to honestly one of the sickest berms we've ever seen until it gets holes. We're worried about oversteering because Jim's quite the turner into this rock, so yeah, we're gonna get Grace on a spade in a bit. She's gonna get some dirt on that for us or a pad. I don't think I need a spade. Just a pad, eh? Just, just the pad, Grace. So you get a pad for us, we're happy too. <laughs> yeah, I'll lift it. It's covered before something. It's not. I like this. You've got you've got full natural section. Pick your line. Hopefully you're gonna come up there and shoot up here, hover over the rock and rip the next turn. Right, out of this now for the natural section. We kind of got enduro line here. How heavy? Bit flat, but hit the turn good because that's gonna pump some speed. Either high here, we've got a little rut down low. But Bernard, when you're racing, you've got to go harder. We've got some lovely bluebells, say ladder. A little off camber. You've got to get this, get that turn because that is an important turn this in a race sick, though, bro. Yeah, this is sick. Just going to keep the camp rolling here for your hardline whales testing. we got coming up ahead, you can probably just see up the camera now as a 90 degree hip that looks not workable. <laughs> the boys have done an unreal job building here. Mad shout out to Al, Simo, the whole dig crew, Dan, everyone that's been a part of this, Dennis now, Jim. Boys have gone hard. Huge respect for all the work they've done throughout the deepest, darkest days of winter, but I'm not sure about this jump. So we got off camber down here and then speed looks like it could be an issue. Larder here. Larder. Don't want you get washed away down. This is called the waterfall as you can see. And we are at the waterfall's edge. Larder me up. So down here. Oh, it looks way smaller now, but it still looks insane. I don't want to say too much because I haven't got down to it yet and Jesus sure me it's better than I think but I don't think you're going to have to speed for this personally Are these grippy or not? Yeah. Uh, we've got a huge kink there It's not as kink there as Kel said but there is a lump in the middle Lada it's, it's a longer way than you think of literally no running It's a 90 degree right lander This is gnarly Hello so this is what we've got here, and then we got this death thing here. Right, the waterfall hip needs some more boarding. We think it needs to be a bit shorter and more of a straight, so she ain't gonna work. This could be some of the most insane photos mountain biking's ever produced if it works. It'll work. And then we go back into a gnarly rock thing. So you go off that, hit the brakes into a gnarly tight rock chute. Oh, this is actually really gnarly. How do we get through here? She like come through the rocky chute and try and turn over some diagonal rock. Stay high. Okay, what have we got here? Just some nice like loamy dirt bracken. Oh, this be a nice. Oh, oh, until you see what's down there. Yeah, this is like. I'll tell you in a sec. Right, we come off the little loamy shoot. We got, I'm not, I'm just trying to tell you some honest opinions. We come over some rocks here, down, flat, and it's becoming inevitable that we're getting towards a canyon gap. This is gnarly. That's a big gap. There's a huge gap down there. This is cool. Are you riding this tomorrow? Yeah. <laughs> They're gonna be stuck. There, so we're like coming off this little wooden bridge here. 
and then this stand is where them we get on, a gnarly stand them on the wall line if you can. You can get like a right, eh? rock shoot thing. Yeah. So we're going down now into the, what's this called? Do you even know? River Gap. The waterfall. Gap. What's that? Waterfall Snake Gap, and this is Snake River Gap. The Snake River Gap. So we're going down steep. No, oh, you shoot. Jim said he. Jim says shotgun that he's going first <laughs> down this. I think it'll be cruise this. Yeah. 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 A lot of weight. If I do this tomorrow. It's not a big gap. It, 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 I know it sounds dumb, but it's not a big gap as it looks already. Lot of man this way! Leave the rock! What's this? Come here. It's a rock roll and I don't want to run off this next rock to look at it. Alright, G3 Diverter Stream. No idea what I've got to do with this because this is terrifying. <laughs> We've got a rocky muddy roll in, a rock slab here, a lot of weight, and then you've got a gap off it onto some wood on scaffolding. Oh yeah, you got a gap onto it, you can't roll. Oh, fuck yeah, Barney. You can't roll, this is... Why have it where you could roll onto this huge canyon gap? <sighs> Which is the easiest way down left. Yeah. Oh. All right, so you come down this muddy, wet rock face here, and then gap onto the scaffolding. We're in the gap now and it's still probably a solid 15 20 foot to get onto this horrible structure. Yeah, where it is. Oh, here he is, Matt Ball. What have you put us in for? Hello, mate. How, How are you? Are you? Oh, I'll grab him. Get eaten alive. Yeah, and that. <laughs> right, I'm gonna finally look at this stupid gap of the Atherton brothers that have made this happen. Wait, this is your fault. That is more than 70 feet. No, it's far, isn't it? Have you measured it? Yeah. With a tape? No. <laughs> <laughs> so if you look like. Looks about 70. <laughs> it is measured with a tape. Imagine like 10. Yeah. I think I'd rather overshoot it. Yeah. This is terrifying, I'm not gonna lie. You could go quite deep. I reckon from where you are in the air, the down will be 100 foot in the air at least. 100 feet up. Yeah, least. the gap's down is bigger than the gap across. Way bigger. <laughs> terrifying. Like I'm river. nervous if you can't tell. Rather you wait there, huge run in. Foot in the air. <laughs> Dan reckons it's gnarly, do you reckon it's easy? <laughs> Neither of us are doing it. <laughs> Neither of them are doing it. <laughs> I would like a seven foot ply case pad, a janky case pad. Please. As a professional mountain biker, apparently this is what I do these days. Uh -huh. oh. oh yeah. Come here yeah. Oh, I'm not a fan. I'll be a fan if we grease this tomorrow. Wait. Ridiculous. I come here, I actually think it looks worse from this side. I got totally better. It looks like a big cliff. Son, come here. You need to wait. It's pretty gnarly up here. Lada. Come here. Still a long way, mate. Still a long way down. Sit. Wait. It's still absolutely massive from this side. Oh, a lot of why we got ourselves into this. 
If you had vertigo, you wouldn't want to be here. I kind of do. Not really. I'm scared of heights a bit, but I say I'm scared of heights. So I might jump this. <sighs> How do we arrive here in life? We're going to get off this and have nightmares tonight about that. But anyway, <laughs> we're going to go quickly look at where we join into the dirty turn. Right, what's this? Come on! This man's had a huge afternoon out. Three hours in the mud for you? Oh, okay. And we got a roller, little stool kind of thing, and then back in, drop down, dirty ferns on off. It's the dirty fern step down. It is still quite long. Maybe, do you know what? Maybe the scaffold jump looks massive because I haven't seen a big jump lately. Like World Cups honestly have tiny, tiny jumps in the grand scheme of things. This step down here would be bigger than anything we've had at World Cup this year. So maybe that's why the scaffold jump looks so big. We'll put it to that. It's going to be fine. <laughs> right, we're on the on off. Which still doesn't look small. It's still a massive section. So this is, they call these the 90s. I think it's like 86 feet to the top of the good knuckle. And it still does look really big. It is, it's hard to say because it looks kind of smaller than the, the scaffold jump we were just on, the snake wizard twist or whatever it's called. But this is still a really long way but big step down, which the other one is not. It's six inches higher on the landing than the takeoff. Right, that's us wrapped up. Track walk for testing. We're gonna be back tomorrow, maybe a bit of bike park first. Ride the top new stuff, hit the big jump. Right, it's the next day. It isn't raining now, but... Cheers, Steph, see you at the warehouse. Um, oh, excuse me. We take the 964 back over to the warehouse and get ready for the day. I think it might be a casual jersey kind of day, even for testing. I might beat, but I'm for a big esports fans. Helmet, bike. Steve just getting the Akima rack on, the Landy. I'm gonna load this sucker up. It's gonna be our shuttle vehicle for the day. Easy, Jordan, cheers, Steve. What time are you leaving? Well, we're gonna go do a couple laps at the bike park. It's 9.47, do a few laps there, warm up. Yeah. And then we'll be back by here in a couple hours. Right. Nice one. Yeah, we'll swing back by. Right, we're here. We're going to do some warm-up laps. Matt Jones here, he might tow us into the canyon gap. You haven't even seen it, have you? I didn't. Until I got here, like, I've only come to ride my new bike, and now I've discovered that there's like this testing phase on. Not hype. We're going to go warm up here, but yeah, we'll see. Don't really know what to say. No, I'm going to do the same. <laughs> Jeez, King. Ready? Ready for this? Uh, what are we going to do? Just a little huge canyon gap later. Blasted by right. No, we're going to stop at the first road. Jeez, man. You can follow G if you want. I don't really know I'm going down this. Really? Yeah. You must have done I've done like so seven man. laps down this probably ever. I reckon I've done hey. 700. Yeah. Right, you ready, Matt? Yeah, I am. Right, come on, boys. Nah. Follow Matt. Come on, boy. Jump. Yeah. Boy. Yeah. yeah, boy.
doing it. That was sick. Jim is definitely feeling more confident on jumps than me. Oh, I didn't ever know Dabby was this mid-east central. You ready? Jen, are we dropping? I just can't really roll at Go your Jimbo. speed. Go Jimbo. It's a bizarre thing. My Joe's leading. Joe. I can but I, I can't. Yeah, good lad. So your case ever since. <laughs> Go on. Go on. Go on, on. Go on, Go on Jim. Jim. You're now facing Yeah. Nah, it's good. We love it. That was sick. Ready, love? Yeah, like you got it down. easy. Just Whoa, drop off at like normal. Nice case, and he just. Go on, lads. Am I still? <laughs> yeah. Go, Jim, boy. There you go. Take it down for me. Yeah, go! That's sick! Woo! Yes, crew. Right, I think we're ready to go try and jump a river, as Matt said. <laughs> there is revved up because he doesn't have the thing. We've got a new addition. He's actually at the warehouse now, and it looks like he's going to come up to the top of the track with us to test it. With a bike. With a bike. So it's going to be three. Jim Monroe, <laughs> Matt Jones, myself, about to head up and hopefully be as excited as Lada Man once we get over this river. Matt is here to steal the glory of hitting the river gap first, but I you know what? I'm gonna let him have it. Happening. Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. yeah, of course. And you knew. Well, you, how many people have you told? Pun? Literally no one. Exactly, so how would I have known? I just came here to ride my bicycle. Grace? I don't ride for Grace. Yeah, you ride for Grace. <laughs> Matt rides for Grace. <laughs> right, we're back. Lara, you're frothing this a bit more than I am, I reckon. Ah, dear. You've got no idea how real this is getting, Lara. This is getting pretty real. Bowley, how are we? Very well, you. <laughs> Not ready sure. for it. Oh, who's this guy? What a day. <laughs> Weird that you're in your riding kit. <laughs> I'm not here. <laughs> yeah, Jim, if you land on it, you're going forward, but don't stand on the new case pad. Anyone else that's like going up, obviously just. Get in there, Steve. Get in there. Right, we've got four bikes loaded up. Yeah. Oh, you do. What's up lads? How are we? <laughs> well, hopefully we're not crashing. Ah, <laughs> uh, we're good. Right, we're here at the... Wow, look at it, the row gap. Wow. Looks wow. unbelievable. Look at that net, it's like a waist <laughs> height. Look at that. Yeah, boy. Right, this is us at the top. It's time to put some body armor on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's going to be loud and be hyped because we're going to need it. Well, we've had a hot mic on us. Hysteria. And Red Bull needs to delete that after they get it. Oh, yes, lads. Let's go. Have fun, Steve. Yeah, yeah good hang luck. On, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, yeah, we've got an absolute swamp here. Oh, you're going flat, yeah. Yeah. Flat is flat. I'm wheel spinning. Oh, that's that. Oh my god, I can't believe that was. Just mad like this. On track. Oh, wow. Opening minute now. We're here. Really gnarly shoot and mad and rock. Do you believe us yet? Yeah. 
and I should have learnt my lesson really. It's just down there as well. Tasmania, not yeah, well, we're, we're going to roll, dude. Just keep rolling. No one's ridden there before. I've so never looked at anything. I don't. Anything? I promise you, no, I don't even know the difference between a rock and a road gap. Anything over the crest, it's actually like pretty horrible, and there's like one or two lines that will work. Can you keep your tyres on the ground? We'll stop before each crest. You can follow us. Alf and Cogs are down there. We'll stop next to them. Right, mate. I'll follow G if you want, and you follow Jim. Yeah. But I'm capable, I can do it. Yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing to surprise you. Yeah, G man. Yep, Get it, boys. Look at this huge bit of mud straight away. Far right and over. <laughs> That is real gnarly. It's way slippier than it looks. Yeah, Jim boy. <laughs> Woo! Oh! It's quite slippery, eh, boys? I'm not here. So slippery. <laughs> yeah, G man. Watch out, Jonesy. It's even gnarly, even I've ridden this like 200 times this bit. Oh. What? I made that look hard! I did not do that pretty. This is all going to be so gnarly. Dude, I got sketchy on that. I'm trying to come into this quick and like, what are you going to do? But I reckon if you go where I am now... Alright, Josh. Don't mind you. I'm good. And then I'm going to hop, I'm even going to push back now and do it. I'm gonna yeah, roll through here. Over there, over there, and then just. I'm just gonna hop that. Am I good? Jim boy, I'm gonna hop left. It's so slippy. It's gnarly, eh? Oh dear, this is so real now. Oh, stop there, you're not gonna. It's just that little fucker. Maybe. Mate. Yeah. So you see you gotta roll into this. Not go too quick you've got to hit that little compression and gap. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna come all the way out to where G is. It's so hard to break here. That's what, gonna be alright though. What's isn't around it? that corner? Nothing, another... you got a big run no, out really. Out. No jumps or more jumps. You got a tight left eventually into another strop like this. You know what's gonna be hard is to not wander left on this chute, so you're pointing like the knuckle. Yeah, but we have got a good little bit in the middle there and then a little gap. I just want to get this done. Yeah, I think you should do it. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's just coming far left there. I think here's good, like you could come in and then get good here. I'm going to turn off that, get through here, onto it, roll as slow as I can. Just yeah, I don't want to let off here because you don't want to speed into that pocket. You've got a compression, I'm going to go as slow as I can. I'm going to have a kick on that drop. No, so you want to like come in slow, I think. Yeah, I just do a little pop. I'm just right going to come in over this now and just do a little hop. Creep in. I'm, I'm going like to creep. Roll, roll, roll. Right. Yeah, right, I'm ready. Get it done, Bernie. I got that one up there good, didn't I? Watch out, Matt. Yeah. yeah. Huh? No, that's all good. It's good grip.
Woo. It's quite hard to stop. <laughs> oh, there's one done. Yeah, G man. Love it. Who's coming? Yeah, Jim. Yeah. You, we're only just stopping. Yeah, boys. Yeah, Jonesy. <laughs> Next up, yeah, Jim. Yeah. It's gnarly, eh? Yeah. You want me like through here? Speed, I think. Yeah, that's what I thought. Can you roll that? No, you got a gap. Could you roll and pull? Yeah, yeah. that's what we're going to do. Yeah, roll and pull. Put onto that rock. Like, roll onto the rock and pull oh, again. That's wild. So you're not gonna Pretty jump, wild. You're not, not going to jump from where you're stood? No, nah, I'm going to roll onto the rock and go again. If you go from here, I think you have too much speed to turn. Is that pretty hard pack, Dan? Yeah. Solid. Let's have a look, we'll push back. Yeah, you kind of need to see someone hit it. Yeah, boys. I'll pedal in now, I reckon I got it pretty good. What are you, you thinking, Bernard? Just take her off, get it done. Let's have a look, G-Man. The good thing is our tyres are quite clear here. Nah, mid. It's more a pool than you think. Yeah, G man, easy. Yeah, yeah mate. Yes, G man. Oh. Oh, yes, Matt. Ready? Jonesy going hard. Yeah, Jim boy. Yeah, Jim! <laughs> Tweaking it! Rip it! Oh! Yes! So good! We're just saying now, these aren't bike park berms, these are like private, insane turns. Racing through here and ripping this is gonna be... like a seven up video, doesn't it? Dude, like a seven up video, it's gonna be insane. Right, we're rolling down the old track to get to the gnarly one. Oh! Oh, I love this track. Oh! Yeah, boy. Sketchy guy. That is gnarly! <laughs> Come here. Come here. No, he's not, is he? he is if he keeps going from here. No, he's not. Oh my god! That's yes, G Man! Oh, oh my, my gosh! God. Fair play! Oh my god! I don't think I can stop. Yeah. Alright, G's an absolute natter and he's gapped off the rock onto the wood. You can probably see on a tiny dot on here. And this problem still is we're going to have so much speed. How much do you scrub off or do you just let off the brakes and get to here? Let's do on off and stop. Alf, move over like a foot left. Huh? Yeah, man. I'll wait. I, I, I'm only going to judge. If we go over this and we feel like we've got a good speed, I'll keep going. 
That bike's so heavy from the fucking mud. I know. It's just that last bit. It's just that last bit. I think realistically, I'm just going to pedal at this, pump over this, pump it, hit that, and we should be dialed, we'll know. Yeah. You ready? Watch out, John's it. Do you want to come with as well? We've got a whole crew. I'll go behind you. Yeah, yeah. You good, Jim boy? Yeah. We were going slow I, for the... I've never pulled so hard to get Yeah, we were something. going slow for that, eh? I yanked on the bars as hard as I could. Had a lot harder here. Is this on? Uh, yeah, you're on, mate. You boys ready? Yeah. No. Who's going? What Me, Jim, in? then you, Matt, yeah? What gear are you in? The hard this? one? Yeah, hardish. I'm going to click a couple down here, though. Here, Matt. You're going to follow Jim, yeah? Yeah, I'll leave a gap, though. I don't want to drown. Yeah, I'll leave a gap. You good? Yeah. Yes, boys. Yeah, boy, I told you we were going slow. Did you Case get them good? Case the second one. Huh? Case the second one. I just heavy. got it. Like pretty heavy, actually. I knew we were going slower. Woo! Yep. Here, Jim, now get it. <laughs> fast We are going fucking fast though. Right, loving these. Matt's coming in now. Oh. <laughs> Pretty front high there. Oh my. <laughs> Love it. So I reckon, right, we're pushing over now. We're going to hike over, do some runs on the wood, and try and work out speed for this. It's not that big, but obviously you want to clear it. Quite. A logistical mission, you can get them across this. Yeah. You can see, you got it. Oh dear, this is this side. It's not that far, but it is really far. Hey yeah, boys, Matt, right up. yo, right up. Hey. yo. He's just on the edge, no, fuck me. Oh, yeah. so hard to go. You, you look ready, boys. We were. I'm coming up. I stopped so easy. I need to do a let off the brakes and yeah, hit, yeah. you know, to see how much yeah, speed yeah, I'm going to gain. Course. That's what we need to learn you now. Break it from the top then. We need to learn how much speed you yeah, pick you up. Yeah, need to feel what it'll feel like. Yeah, I need to let off the brakes for half a second and I stopped so easy of you boys. So savage as well then. That looks dead. So horrible. <laughs> He's breaking from the start though. So hard to judge. 
coming off that rock to get in fucking quicker. Oh yeah. <laughs> what do you reckon you're gonna to go too fast? I just don't know, dude. I think it won't be far off to no brakes from here. Will that be enough? Yeah, I think so. You pick up so much speed when you like not uh, breaking through that bottom transition. There's no way to test it. Really. No. Good, if I do another one of those with more speed, because I couldn't stop then. Make sure you don't get kicked out when you break. Just just to watch, yeah really, and see what you think. Just opinions. You boys good? Can we go. Benefit from that? Yeah, because I'm starting to feel it now. I want to go quicker what is, again. What is the acceleration like? Mental after you go past Simo. You boys good? Off yeah, so I braked the whole way, but I got a bit slidey here. Brake, 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 hop. I braked instantly. I'm going to try now. I'll go a bit quicker to really test the speed out. Hardest bit is we don't know how fast we can go when we hit it. I know the speed I want, but I won't know until I'm off it. What's the technique right here? Yeah, boys! Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. What a boy. I think you'd be perfect. Watch out quick. I think you're cruising. Yeah, boy. I reckon it's, it's hot, good, no it? brakes. Yeah, yeah, no brakes. And you can cruise the lip. Full speed, and I can play with the lip, can't I? Try and not go too high. Right, not too far. I think the lip will be sweet. Pardon? I think the lip will be sweet. Yeah, it's just hop this, no brakes it. Because I don't want to be going too slow, do I? But you boys think speed's dialed. Hop, no brakes it. And just cruise off the lip, you reckon? As soon as I hop there, just do not brake. And just sail over the lip. 
The no braking bit is going to feel gnarly, eh? But you can brake. Fun? You feel like you need to brake when you Yeah, for the lip. Back. Yeah, exactly. Good way. Yeah, good shout. Yeah, because I can just... stop. Of course you can scrub your speed off. Do it well. Yeah, so if I go... I can always scrub speed at the end, rather than going too slow. Because that is a long way to go. Hop. No brakes. And just a little jump. Got it easy. Hell yeah, Bernard. Yes! Oh! Yes! Oh my god. Oh! That was the most scared I've ever been. Oh. Bit slower! <laughs> Don't look right. Oh. Don't turn right. Oh my god. That wasn't bad. Terrifying. Oh, you're right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> How you doing, oh. Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Yeah, mate. That was scary. Yeah, that was quite scary. Do you want to see it? Oh. So you got to hop, dude. Perfect. Dude, look at that. Fuck me, I almost missed it. Fuck. Here we go. Go on, Matt. Yeah, Matt. Yeah, Matt. Perfect. Yes, boy. How was that? The break was perfect, eh? Because you went with the lip. Could have more. Yeah, you could have. Oh, I've got real bad jelly legs. I'm going to sit down for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Good lad. I thought you maybe weren't going to go. That lip could change. Yeah, it's too kicky. It's what I said. First thing I said. I was like, I had no. Imp I was like, oh, well now I I'm in the air. Then cool. It's a bit like that. <laughs> what not... am I going to do here? <laughs> That's an eight foot radius. However, eight meter radius. Um, I might do it. I could do it again and scrub a bit more speed because that reduces. The, the, the drive through the lip because we're going he went really fast i went a bit slower but you're still going too quick but um i was I, I was going down a rolling like this and i had to i had to noticeably like look up to see the jump because you're like actually fuck i haven't even looked at the jump yet <laughs> and then like you you turn that almost like whoa and then suddenly you're so far up above where you were you can... and i'm gonna like, see where you landed oh. yeah jim you're the man i know Oh shit. Right, we're gonna sign off now. It's been a heavy day. Is that Jim's? Yes, it's Jim. How's the bike? Bike's good. Yeah, Jim, mad respect, brother. You are somehow hanging in there after an absolute huge e. Testing went pretty solid until the end, until it didn't. That's how testing goes. We've literally seen this man. You'll always put a smile on my face, but Jim, brother, hope you're good. And uh, we'll see you next week at Hardline. If I'm not really sure what's going to happen with this LSD, but hopefully you enjoyed it. As we've got to the end of the video, Jim is fine. He was discharged from hospital at 2 a.m. somehow with no injuries. Obviously, we're going to change the lip. We're going to put a big safety net in there, but hard on his back and uh, we're set for a good week.